Laura, Phil, a lot of people in this community are carrying on as usual, except for with a little bit of nervousness now, uh, considering this incident that happened early this morning. You can see outside the synagogue, security is standing at the entrance. Some people are still lingering around there. And uh, Beverly Hills Police Department tells us that they are adding officers to patrol this area for the night as they investigate this vandalism and look for the lone man they said did it. Here are some pictures of him that were given to us. Uh, he's described as a thin white man, 20 to 25 years old, with short, dark, dark curly hair. And police say he may be wearing glasses, shorts, and possibly low-top Puma tennis shoes while carrying a backpack and a rolling suitcase. This incident happened around 7 o'clock this morning at the synagogue here on Rexford Drive. An employee was the one who noticed it when he got to work before the synagogue had opened and noticed that the doors were open and the items had been ransacked. Now, investigators say this man committed a series of vandalisms through Rexford and Elm Alley south of Wilshire Boulevard. And while he didn't steal anything or hurt anyone, he did damage the synagogue's furnishings, several Jewish relics. He broke windows and broke nine Torahs, which are very valuable to the Jewish community. This was definitely planned, definitely targeted. It's very scary, like being a mom, being Jewish, and it happening down the block from us, it's very scary. This cowardly attack hits at the heart of who we are as a community. It's not just an attack on the Jewish community of Beverly Hills, it's an attack on all of us. How dare they in our city? Now call the Beverly Hills Police Department if you recognize this man or know anything about this incident. The number to call is 310-285-2125. You can also submit a tip by texting B-E-V-H-I-L-L-S-P-D. That's their hotline. Now again, police are investigating this as a hate crime. And earlier this week, uh, Phil, you spoke with experts with the Anti-Defamation League that told us that hate crimes within the Jewish community have been happening uh, for a while. So coming up tonight at 10, we'll talk about that a little more. Until then, I'll send it back to you in the studio. We're reporting live from Beverly Hills. Leah Uko.